everyone, welcome to this review on the Premium Emma mattress. We bought this 18 months ago, so I thought it was probably a good time to do an honest review. We bought and paid for this Emma mattress, it wasn't a free gift, so it'll be true and honest. Now the bed frame that it's sitting on, I will just mention, that's a dusk bed. Um, a lot of controversy on dusk beds, but I have done, again, a full review from unpacking it and let you know what I think. So I'll link that below if you're looking for a bed frame. They're very affordable and I've done a video on that. So without further ado, let's jump in to the Emma mattress. This Emma mattress is in the king size. I did previously have a different sort of memory foam mattress, but we'd had that for about eight years and felt like we needed to upgrade. So I did all the reviews and it said that the premium was slightly firmer. I have to say, I love this mattress. When I go away on holiday, unless I'm staying somewhere really snazzy, I do miss it. The pros of this mattress is very easy to maintain. The cover on the top that you can see here zips off so you can wash it. I've actually just washed it again. You can see, a dodgy looking stain. Just so you know, a bottle of nail varnish leaked on top of it. It's nothing horrible. And then we have some uh, orange squash. Other than that, it's clean as a whistle. Um, and I have, that is slowly coming out. I have to so every time I wash it, I put some vanish on and it's coming off. But this is the protective cover that's on the mattress. It just unzips. Let me show you. So to unzip it, to wash it, super easy. You just zip it like that. <laughs> So here's your top layer, here's your other, now this is all stuck, it's all attached and stuck. And then this piece is stuck as well, and this piece, and they have a massive chunk. And then down here, have these vents, which I'm assuming is to let the air circulate so it doesn't get too hot. And then underneath that is the end of it. So it is completely a humongous chunk. There may be gubbins in here, but I can't see it, but you can see how solid it is. And I think it's the layers, it's not just one chunk that gives it this extra solidness that I really like. So it's super easy to get this off and wash it. It says to wash it 40, I wash mine on low. Um, no ironing, don't tumble dry, it's hang up to dry. I did pop it in the tumble dry and it didn't shrink. So that's that bit there. So with this other mattress, I've seen people doing reviews on the original, which my mum has, she absolutely loves it. I'll also link where I bought hers from because I got a ridiculous price on that. She loves her mattress. This one, if you look at it, there isn't much of a dink. I've seen some people sharing there's a real dink. My husband sleeps on that side and I sleep on this side. He is considerably heavier than me, but we haven't yet got two divots sort of either side where we sleep and a sort of a mound in the middle. As you can see, there just isn't anything. It's just literally as flat. There's a slight bit here, but as I say, he is heavier than me. In the hot weather, and we have had a couple of hot sort of Augusts, I haven't been able to not sleep. And again, in the winter, we don't put any extra blankets on. I mean, we've, we've renovated the house. We have better double glazing, but we just have a duvet. I don't put extra blankets on in the winter or change. I have the same duvet 12 months of the year, and it's never too hot. Obviously, I plug a fan in in the summer, when we had the heat wave, but we still slept on the same bed and we didn't overheat. So that's a definite plus on the previous one I had because I felt in the summer, it was just so hot. We literally couldn't sleep on the mattress. So I think in that regards, it is a good mattress. Price wise, we stupidly paid full price for this mattress. There was at the time a discount, I think it was something like 30% off. So we paid just under 700 pounds for this mattress, which I do regret because my son, which I'll show you his bed in a minute. He has the premium as well, and I pay 225 quid for his double. Uh, I will link where I now will only buy him a mattress for. I will not buy them direct from the website because it's so much cheaper, and his mattress honestly arrived identical to mine. So if you really want a good deal, I will link below where I actually buy my mattresses from now. Regardless now, the maintenance on this mattress, we don't have to turn it or anything, we certainly haven't, but this top piece here just unzips so you can wash it. I've probably washed it about four times, not that much, but I do sometimes give it hoover as well on the top. And if you do need to move it, it has got these side straps here that uh, make it easy to move around. It is very heavy. So that does work well if you've got a hydraulic ottoman bed like this, because when you have a heavy mattress, it lifts up easily. So it's definitely a two person to lift this off. Um, we've recently moved the bed slightly this way because I've just built these wardrobes. 
I'll link them below. So we shoved it this way a little bit, we do have to take the mattress off because it's so heavy you can't move it. So you do feel like you're getting a good quality mattress so for the underside part. of the mattress as well. It's this more of a tougher actually honeycomb fabric. So I think it's got a bit of a non-slip element to it, but the weight of it is so much that it's not going to slip anyway. But it has got this kind of non-slip on the bottom and you can again remove this whole bit. I've never washed the bottom, but you can if you want to. Other pros, I would say the delivery was quite quick when it actually came. And as soon as I put it on the bed, it probably was only a couple of hours and it puffed straight up and we slept on it that night. When we first got it, it did probably take a night of getting used to it, but literally the next day, absolute slept by logs, uh, can't fault it. Other things with the mattress, I would say, I like the fact that it's got the dark color on the side, so it won't stain. And obviously you can wash the top, but you can see the stains that I've had vanish on trying to get out on white. So if this is white on the side, it maybe would be a bit mucky. I don't know. So I do like that. Awesome. Fact. Premium MM mattress. I've just actually taken the top off because he's just come back from university. So I'm giving his bed a whole new zhuzh up. So I'm going to wash the top. But I thought we could show you how easy it is to take it off. So you just unzip it. And then as you can see on his mattress, he's got a very unusual colour on the top uh, on this. He absolutely loves it. He is away at university in a single bed and has told me he is very much missing his mattress. So this again, top layer, middle, third, and a better angle of these vents that we have here. So they're the vents, there. This is like a blue fading to yellowy colour. It's not stain, it's the actual foam is a different colour. So this is his one absolutely loves it can't tell how much he loves it so you can see how easy it is just zip it off here again it's got this is the small double so it's got the removal you can wash this bottom bit as well if you want to just the zip runs all the way around and it's super simple to wash and that's everything i've got to say about this amazing hour mattress i'll link where i buy it in the description box below i sorted a new one for lily in a small double she doesn't know but she's the last one in the house to get one but i've been waiting for it to come back into stock and it's a crazy good price for black friday so i'll link that below so I hope you found that helpful. If you are looking for a new mattress, then great. Don't forget, I have a uh, review of the bed frame as well, which I'll also link below. And if you are looking to build some wardrobes or add panelling, I've got loads and loads of DIY projects that I've done myself on my channel. So I will link them below. So please leave me a comment, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you on the next video.